Like, Hello. Are you Good. How are you? Good, fantastic. Thank you. You too. Have you gone Seven swimming years. since wrapping this film? I don't think so. I, I was okay not seeing the water for a really long time after this movie. We did um, eight weeks straight in the ocean, 13 hours a day, in the ocean and in a tank. So uh, I was pretty ready to be done, especially the tank because they had to just pour so much chlorine into it to keep it clear, to keep the water clear. It wasn't just chlorine, it was other chemicals. But they just had buckets of these chemicals they were pouring in, and our skin just started to fall off and peel, and my skin looked like you know, uh, the Flintstones. So I was, uh, I needed a break from, from the water for a while. You did quite some uh, impressive moves on the surfboard <laughs> in the film. That wasn't so. me. That was Isabella Nichols, who's the number one junior surfer in the world. Though my mom said, people will totally believe it's you, Blake. And I said, Mom, <laughs> I, I would uh, I'd be making a lot of money as a professional surfer if that's how I, if that's how I surfed. <laughs> but you do surf, right? Uh, no, I, you know, I, I learned a little bit for this movie, the proper way to paddle and duck dive and, and, but, you know, catching a wave. If I caught a wave, it would look like, you know, not like that. It would look like me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it would look like somebody who's really proud to have caught a wave and there are probably four people under it keeping the board stable. Mm -hmm. um, in 2010, you actually did go uh, dive with sharks, right? Yes, 2011, yes. 2011, mm -hmm. but, um, how come you wanted to conquer your fear, and, and is this like an added bonus? Yeah, well, you know, I was always afraid of sharks because that's just what's in the the general, um, that's the general conversation around sharks as always, or the ocean is be afraid of sharks. And, and um, I had no reason to be, I wouldn't even see Jaws because I was too afraid that I would never get in the ocean because I'd heard so much about it. And... Um, so I thought, well, I'm terrified of sharks. I need to, I need to get in the ocean and swim with them. So I went cage diving with um, these incredible conservationists who were studying them, and it was amazing to see them in their habitat because they weren't these monsters. When there's not scary musical scores, mm -hmm. you know, exactly. When John Williams isn't there, <laughs> they're actually not scary. They're they're these beautiful creatures in their habitat, and and these conservationists where they're studying them and studying their beauty, and and you know, they had shared with us how they're nearing extinction and uh, because of humans, because of fenning, because of these awful things. And, mm -hmm. and um, it was really, really eye-opening. So when I, when I saw this film, one of the reasons I wanted to take it on was um, because you really understood why this shark was the shark isn't just, I mean, yes, he's a movie monster, but also he's been hunted by human beings, and you see that, and, and you see that it's just two apex predators, a human and a shark, fighting to survive. And I thought that that was a, a special take on it. And it's also a dangerous thing when you do a movie about a shark because it, it spreads fear, and I also wanted to be the one to, to be behind it, to say, go see this movie and go be terrified and enjoy it, but also don't villainize these creatures because, you know, you, you put anything in a movie and you can make it a lot scarier than it is in real life. Don't laugh, but I almost felt this was like a James Bond movie. <laughs> really? Yes. Cool. Um, you know, you have the sexy beach, you have the scary <laughs> villain, uh -huh. sorry, and you have the Bond girl that rocks a bikini. So talk a little what bit. What about the Bond guy? Who's James Bond? Well, he's still to be cast. What? <laughs> Come on. But Just the Bond girl? No, no, no. I want more credit than that. I, I had to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a great white shark. I want to see well, James Bond. Bond. Yes, that's what I'm they saying. I want to see it. James Bond go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a great white shark. Mm -hmm. Nuh-uh. Well, so what's the secret of a great bikini buddy? Don Saladino, he's an amazing tra trainer that I worked with. But, you know, for this movie, it wasn't just, it wasn't going in the gym every day and getting in shape, you know, for the sake of vanity. It was endurance training to be able to keep up with this film because this film was a physical feat as much as it was an emotional one and they didn't even hire a stunt double to the last two weeks so um, I got in shape before shooting but while shooting I got in such better shape because I'm fighting against four foot waves the whole time and I'm doing these long takes that are so 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 physical I mean that's working out 13 hours a day straight basically every day so the trick is to do a movie like this. Yeah, it was worth it because you look good and the movie good. Thank you. That's nice to say. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Good to see you. Thank you for waiting while I...